I recently came across this poly B2 PEX transition. Someone crimped PEX pipe on a poly BT, which wasn't leaking at all, but it could fail big time. Welcome to my YouTube channel, and let me show you how to do a proper transition from poly B to PEX. This gray pipe is poly B, which was discontinued in the mid 90s, and PEX came about to replace poly B, which is this white one. PEX also comes in red, blue and milky white color. Both Poly B and PEX are used in portable hot and cold water lines. If you look closely, inner diameter of Poly B is larger than PEX pipe. That's why Poly B fittings are also bigger in size. I recovered these fittings from scrap pipes we changed with PEX for this video. You can see that ridges on the fittings are also different than each other. But PEX fitting fit into both pipes because they are smaller in size. Some people assume that this is correct fitting and they use them for poly V2 PEX transition. But you shouldn't do that. That can cause leakage which can damage the property. Instead, use this special transition coupling. Diameter and ridges on one side of this coupling matches with poly B and other side matches with PEX. This coupling comes with two rings. They are also labeled which one to use for PEX and which one for poly B. It is very hard to mess up with these rings because PEX ring is smaller in diameter and won't go on poly B pipe easily. Here is a correct demonstration of how everything will go. Put the black ring on PEX pipe and insert the PEX side of the fitting inside the PEX pipe. And put the copper ring on poly B pipe. And insert poly B side of fitting into the gray pipe. And crimp everything together. There is another alternative to this which is using a shark bite push fitting. Shark bite makes a special fitting for poly B to PEX transition. Poly B pipe will go on gray side of the fitting and PEX will go on the other side. Here are some examples from properly done transition. That's all for today's video. Make sure to like my video and subscribe to my channel. See you next time.